This is the biggest brunch in Luxembourg. No! Buongiorno. Come va? Bene. David, si, sì, piacere. Si, 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 madre italiana. Ah, mamma mia, non penso. Si, sì, si, sì, mi piace il tuo occhiale. Ah, grazie. Bello, bello. Si, sì, this is dope. Amazing. Saverio is the owner of this beautiful restaurant. It is the biggest brunch in Luxembourg. It is Italian. We're going to have pasta, bread. They also have sushi. They have seafood. I'm excited. This is amazing. Lots of different rooms here. This is the place to come on a Sunday in Luxembourg. The pizzeria right here. Look at this, guys. This is like a real Italian aroma. Come stai? Pistacchio. Pistacchio. Pistacchio di Bronte e Mortadella. Wow, this is some real good stuff. So this, right here we have the ultimate bread. It's a focaccia. Everybody here is Italian. Wow, the amount of smells, so good. Everything comes from Italy. The wine, they have an anoteca, they have a cocktail bar, they have a sushi bar at the back. They have more and more and more. And I'm gonna try some food. Wow, e questo è tuo favorito? Si, look at this. Mmm. Oh, questo è mortadella? Mortadella. Mm. Ricotta di bufala. The cheese. E crema di pistacchio di bronte. So pistacchio, cheese, bread, and the mortadella. The ultimate. Oh, questo è like so fluffy. The cheese. Wow, this is what you eat in Italy. Amico, questo è massimo. It's crazy. Huh? It is crazy. <laughs> and by the way, brunch is 59 euros, unlimited. That doesn't include drinks. You want a drink? That's on you. <laughs> See, no? Mmm. It's hard because that buffalo cheese is like the best mozzarella on earth. It's so creamy. All right, let's go. We've been here walking around for about an hour. It is so big. It's like forever. Over here they have the beer bar. So World Beer Bar. They have the pizza station or the bread station. Back here they have a whole section of cheese. You see the cheese? The cheese. All the product come directly from Italy. Everything? Yes, everything we, we make homemade. And uh, all the product, two times, we have two trucks by week coming to Drake in Italy. So two trucks per week bring the products from Italy. And over here we have the Mo cheese bar. Mozzarella, bufala, mozzarella, fior di latte. No, all quelle migliore. So, with a, with a truffle. With truffles. Si, sí, because my family is de Umbria. Ah, allora si. Sí, si, yes. sí, de Umbria. Uh, my land is with, truffle land. Yes. We go with the dogs, andiamo con cane, yes, a yes. prendere truffa. Oh, I feel like we have to try some of this. But this is so good. So they have Parmesan cheese, they have buffala, they have so many different ones. I ah, see, sí, see. Sí. I'll try it. Meto de, de Puglia? Si. Sí. Puglia. So Puglia is the heel of Italy. It's one of the best places on earth if you're looking for food and beaches. Oh. 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 It melts. Fresco. Troppo fresco. And these are smoked. Questo formaggio smoked. I mean, we're gonna eat like crazy here. Ma si, un po', no? Con la truffa. Questa è truffa nera, no? Oui, la truffa nera. Yeah, so this is black truffle. Oh, and he's gonna throw some amazing olive oil. Si, sufficiente, grazie. The Calabria. Calabria is another southern uh, Italian region. Beautiful. Southern Italy is a whole different world. She's just giving me a mountain of cheese. Okay. Sì, uno, prendiamo uno di questo. E eh, wow, con arugula. Picante, questo picante. <laughs> it's okay. They speak everybody's trilingual. Wow. Sì, no? Ma tu parla che era francese? No, italiano. Normalmente, ma adesso parla francese. No, va bene, va bene. Sì, sì. So the, the parmesan cheese. You know, this is the, if, if you want to help your bones stay like durable your whole life, you get a little bit of Parmesan every day, pure calcium. And this right here, this cheese, he does it a la mano, no? Con walnuts, this one has pistachio. Bello. Ah, I'm moving here. 
straight up. Yeah. I'm gonna walk around with cheese all day. This is Anduya. Anduya. Calabria, typical. So it's typical the Calabria. So yes. it's a traditional Calabrian cheese, and it has salchicha. <laughs> So it has like a like a chorizo. It's a hot. Yeah, spicy a spicy, spicy. sausage. Grazie. La focaccia sì, l'ho provato. Era un'altra cosa. It's like a different world. Delicious. All right, let's go over here. We have all the cold cuts. Here we have mortadella, eh, prosciutto, prosciutto with truffle. This one looks so good. Sì, prendiamo uno di queste. Eh, che, che pensi? Because it, it tante cose qua. That's the problem. Is there's so much food, and you, you, how much stomach can you have? You know, like you have from 11 to 4 to eat. You know what? I'll try the smoked cheese. Oh, oh, questo sicuramente. I love the music too. So she's gonna give me an assortment of cold cuts. This is very traditional in Italy, but melone con prosciutto. Questo è quale queste? Speck. 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 So over here they have the focaccia. This yeah. is some very fluffy bread. It looks like there's tomato on top. And this bread, it's also made of bread. It's uh, artisanal bread. Yes. Cominciamo yeah. con questo. This is just yeah. the appetizer. Yes, just for the start. Just for the start. Yes. The traditional mm -hmm. ranch. Normally you drink also with the Francia Corta. Francia Corta. So yes. we're going to try with La Francia so Corta. Francia Corta. You start with this. And so we're walking past the Anoteca. That's like the wine room over here. Beautiful hallway over there full of products. And over here we have the sushi bar. Yes. It's good. The problem is no più mani. <laughs> like I have no more hands for this. This is amazing. So this is the sushi bar. There's gyozas. There's sushi. So nigiri. Eh, que piu. Che sushi rolls. Uh, my friend over there is yes, from Brazil. Si, yes. Brazil. So where do we go? There's too much. You have to eat this and come back. Over there they have a salad bar. Here they have some fried stuff. La crepe. Look at the crepe. And my friend over here is from Gubbio. Gubina. La Gubina. La Gubina. She's making Nutella crepes. This is how we do it in Italy. Always with la Nutella. Let's go guys, let's go. I mean it's so much. Pastry bar. Tiramisu. We have forever things. Wow. Let's go here, let's go here. I'm gonna get a grappa. It's one of my favorite things ever. It's the still grapes. But let me try this before we go over there because I'm really excited for this one. Prosciutto with black truffle. Wow. It's orgasmic, guys. Oh my God. The black truffle, so fresh. My mouth is salivating, I need to get another one. Better than Italy. Well, it's Italy and Luxembourg. Every room is different. Wine everywhere. E quale queste? This distillery is from 1890 in Nebarolo. E dove è queste? Piemonte. Piemonte. So this is in north, one of the northern regions that closer to Switzerland. No? Vado. Sì, sì. And this is how you say cheers in Italian. Brindiamo. Insieme. Sì, Davide, piacere di, di piacere. averti qua Anche io. con noi. Grazie, grazie. Eh, il Lussemburgo, grazie. Uh, that's strong. Yeah, it's nice, no? It's beautiful. It's not too bad. Like, I think this is an easy one to take easy, down. Yeah, because yeah. sometimes the grappa is so strong, almost like raki or rakia, that where it's like, you know, it heats you up. This is perfect. Molto fina. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, that's the one she does by hand. It looks amazing with walnuts. Dio mio. Dio caro. Oh, that's gonna be the best one, bro. La burrata con trufa. So I went to the kitchen and let them know we're coming in to see them make incredible pastas. But before we go in, I'm gonna try this fluffy focaccia. I'm gonna open it up and I'm gonna put the most amazing burrata of all time. If you guys don't know what burrata is, it's one of the fluffiest, creamiest cheeses ever with truffle. Oh, it's like straight from the cow.
The best burrata I've ever had in my life. Yeah. Whoa. I'm blown away. It's so good. This is not mozzarella, this is burrata. La focaccia <laughs> with tomato. And this was an old garage. Right here, we have yes. where the cars were parked. Yes. Literally, they left it there. Yes. Amazing. Before, it's uh, my shop for the furniture shops because I'm a designer. Oh, you're a designer? Yes. It's my first, Italian. My first job for 30 years. And uh, it's, uh, I try for two cooking just for two joke with my friend for eating my uh, the, the kitchen for my mother kitchen yes and uh, just I for cook. fun yes for the fun for fun he was <laughs> cooking and then it, out of nowhere start. this yes. started yeah. so it started very small and then it kept expanding yes. expanding expanding yeah. now he has the best brunch in luxembourg on a sunday you yes. come here at 11 a.m and you're gonna be blown away Three thousand square meters. andiamo andiamo thank you let's go inside pause the time wow so many people. So you come here, you can ask for whatever pasta you want, ravioli. Devi fare le geste un po' più lento. Sì, solo per la camera, perché se no... Crazy. Il ritorno. That's it. Un po' di parmigiano. Yeah, of course. Un po' di più. Look at that beautiful parmesan. Un po' più. We're doing it street food style. We taste together. Mm. Mm. That's a real pasta. Oh, how about this? I think this is the national dish of Italy. Yes. It's amazing. Super thick penne pasta. I personally love creamy pastas, but this, the ingredients, the meat, the tomato sauce, plus parmesan. Nah, I'm blown away by the food. I've never seen a ravioli that big. So he's gonna make this one first. These are some monster raviolis. Wow. Look at these massive ravioli. We have the Parmesan cheese, tomato on top. I'm gonna cut it in half so you can see the ricotta and the spinach. Grande. I've never felt more at home in my life than here. This is epic, so fresh. There's nothing like Italian pastas from the source. Everything here comes from Italy. We make so the ravioli fresh. here. Ravioli here? Yeah. This morning, we cook the ravioli. Yeah, tomate, tomatino. So Francesco's the one who is the head of all the pasta. E anche la carne? Cosa sono? Carne c'è altre persone. Sì, e tu dove sei? La pasta, di dove sei in Italia? Salerno. Salerno? Ah, ok, so everybody here is from a different city. It's really amazing. It's like you're, you're just traveling all to Italy here, every region. Salerno, Napoli, Palermo, Lecce, Mose. I mean, it's like epic. Oh, whoa. Mm? Look at that. Italian sausage, it, Italian porchetta. And this, guys, this is La Porchetta. This, la porchetta. when you go to Florence, you get the Porchetta sandwich. It's pork, but they also add some herbs. You get the fat. Lo prendo così? Just like this. Look at that fat layer. Nothing like it. The herbs, so much flavor. So savory. Mmm, salty. Look at that. Wow, it's dripping with oils. It's the Landuja Pimenta della Calabria. Oh, so that's, that's pepper from Calabria. If you guys know Calabria, Calabria, if the boot, this is Puglia and this is Calabria on the way into Sicilia. Just before to Sicilia. Yeah, amazing. Un giorno, io volevo fare un giro con macchina e cruciare a Sicilia. Si, andiamo insieme. I'll go with you, for we sure. Go. We go together. We, we go in the Austin Martin. Uh, opa! <laughs> Il movimento piano, Michele. Piano deve servire. Sì, un più piano. This is a champ it's Italian champagne, but it's not prosecco. This is like another level. Grazie. It is a Francia corta. Francia corta? Francia corta, sì. 
Francia Franciacorta, Michele. Hey. Vieni con noi, parla Sin, del Franciacorta. È una bollicina della regione del Lombardia, è una zona circoscritta che sta per la Francia Corta. Andiamo, grazie per tutto. Sì. Mm. Good. Buono, buono. Devi mangiare questo. Questo? È la crosta della porchetta. You want me to eat the skin of the yes. pork. It's oily, it's fatty, it's crunchy. Crazy, yeah? Huh? It's hard to explain its flavors. The oil, the fat. Mm. But you need this to cleanse your palate. My big chef. There's a big chef right yes. here. Do you say? Arturo. Portugal. Ah, Portugal? Si. Ah, Portuguese. Eh, si. He's not Italian, he's Portuguese. De, de dove? Lisboa? No, Porto. Porto o Porto? Si, o Porto is good. Eh, la Francesina. Yeah. La Francesina. Yeah, it's, it's an amazing uh, sandwich. Ah, si? Oh, buono, buono. Si, si, si. So we're gonna try some sausage. The, the porchetta, he make, uh, Arturo, he make the porchetta. Oh, yeah? So he yeah. makes the porchetta. Speciality for the ricetta di Arturo. Incredible. Yeah. Molto buono e mo, molto buono. Molto buono. Molto buono, sì. Ancora comincio a parlare tutte le lingue. Sì, sì. Perché no? Spicy sausage with some peppers from Calabria. Every bite is orgasmic. Yeah. Sì, no? Yes, yes, yes. Oh. And here we are entering the kitchen. Oh my gosh, che fai lì? Oh, è sugo. Il sugo per le omar. So he's basically making like a lobster broth. È come un broth, come... Sì. E che è quello? Ooh, he's gonna light on fire. Oh! It's crazy. So here he's making like a tomato based broth with lobsters and uh, eh, come un langost langostino questo. I've never seen this. So what do you have in there? You have celery, tomato, it's sugo. So the sauce for the pasta. All right, let's go, let's go. Dove andiamo? Sushi or, or pesce? Pesce, let's go, let's go for seafood. See the problem with the pasta is you get too full. You need to have just a tiny bit of pasta and then have the seafood. Uh, it doesn't end here with the champagne. No, Francia Corta. No, ma mai l'ho visto. Francia Corta. Oh, sera è uguale allo champagne, lo stesso metodo e lo stesso Per i francesi no, ma yeah, yeah. champagne si può chiamare solo in Francia. Non siamo in rivalità eh, con Exactly. So they're saying it's almost yeah. the same as champagne, the only thing is they can't call it champagne because it's not from the champagne region. Not but for the for the French people. Eh? No, 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 obviously. Sorry for the French people, but uh, it's Italian and uh, Is it better? Yeah. Okay, let's go for seafood. He's slowly getting me drunk here. And I'm enjoying it. So over here we have shrimp with olives. Over there we have fried shrimp. And at the very end we have cauliflower and broccoli. And this is calamari, fried calamari. Oh, still so hot. Mamma mia. Crudente. Crunchy. The raw bar. Here we have oysters. We have nails, snails from the sea. You got salmon. So smoked salmon, octopus, you got shrimp, calamari, and mussels. And over there, look at the never-ending amount of oysters. Oysters, oysters, oysters. Per me, ostra, sempre. Dieci, venti, cinquanta. You got lobster, you have shrimp, all fresh. This one is how you do it, you slurp. I, I don't know France. I have to go to France one day. To all my French people here, please let me know where should I go in the future. Bordeaux. I want to go to Bordeaux for the wine. Mm. Okay, so next we're going to get some crabs. Crab claws. Quale? Is it lobster claws? It's a lobster. Yeah, he puts a bunch of lemon on it. 
So the way we do this just is get ready, get, get dirty. Woo Look at that meat. <gasps> wow. This will be succulent. Mm. So fresh. Oh, wow. I don't think I've ever had this. Veramente, no, 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 mangiato con una cosa così. Mai. Freschi, freschi, non congelati. Yeah, never frozen. Io sono il suburghese. Ah, sì, lo suburghese? Sì, perché quando io parlo con una persona è sempre di un'altra parte, no? Mia madre è italiana e mio padre è francese. E quante lingue parla? Quattro. Quattro? Okay, next up sushi. I'm like trying to get through this. Oh, a lot of food, but everything's so good. And I love it because when you enter this part of the restaurant, it is literally like being in an Italian restaurant on the sea or a Greek restaurant, right? Wow, I'm blown away. Over here, some fried stuff. So, questo come un falafel. It looks like falafel. I don't know if it really is. Over there we have vegetables, and over here we have the sushi bar right there. Oh. Ma Luigi, che fai? Eh, eccoci qua. Ho portato un po' di vino buono direttamente dall'Italia. <laughs> <laughs> He's a sommelier. He just came here on the Vespa with some wine. This is how they do in Italy. Amazing. Abbiamo sicuro da assaggiare. E qual è queste? Queste vino? Vino del del sud della Campania, un greco di tufo del nostro amico Leonardo Delisio. Andiamo subito a assaggiare questo fantastico vino. Napoli che sono campione del mondo, sì, oh, campione dell'Italia quest'anno. So the reason why they say the white wines in the south are really good because of sun, the heat, no? Sì, sì. Perché è troppo caldo lì. Greco del tufo, so Greek of tufo. Prendiamo. Salute. Grazie, grazie. Salute. Grazie, grazie per tutto. Oh my gosh. You know it's dry, but it still has a little bit of fruit. Po' di frutta, no? Oh, love it, ice cold, ice cold. We take the Somalia with us. VIP. <laughs> Cheers. Andiamo, andiamo. So here we have the sushi bar. So good, so fresh. Gyoza, uh, this is fried shrimp. And then over here, we have the nigiri, we have some uh, rolls. You make it every day, fresh. Oh wow, so if you want, you can get sake, but we're sticking to the Italian style. Okay, this is our sushi plate. Come cominciamo con questo? Everything. Come dobbiamo cominciare? Alright, so I love this. The wasabi. Wasabi, yeah. Ginger and soy sauce. I make this a maison. Okay, make this shrimp. Scampi. Salmon flambe. Salmon fresh. Tuna fresh. Uh, maki salmon. Uh, maki tuna. Cui. Maki California scampi. And salmon California. We have wasabi, nice spice, but my friend hasn't seen my hot sauce. Questo mio, mi picante. <laughs> tu lo previ. We'll put it right here a little bit. Vai, io prendo queste. I want the salmon flambe, so they nuke this. E con la salsa mia, sicuramente. I'll try it with my sauce. Mmm, so fresh. Molto buono. Molto buono. Get some of that soy right there. Mm. I love the sushi bar. You got some tuna. I love the soy sauce. Soy sauce is key ingredient when you're eating sushi. I really love this place. I love this place. Oh, homemade sushi. Says my man. Oh, so he won the World Sushi Championship 2017? He's an award-winning sushi chef. I love it. In Tokyo. Ah. Arigato. I ah, that's so good. The one thing that gets me, sushi, every day. I just keep eating it all. Mmm. So fresh. Good, right? A little bit? A little hot, yeah? A little hot. And then we have sake. Very good. <laughs> That bottle is yours. It's for you. I'm gonna finish it. I feel bad my man here, but you know he's the owner. He can eat all day if he wants. Mm. Tempura gyoza. Senti. Gyoza. Gyoza. It's a fried dumpling. Mm. Oh, and this is tempura. 
If you guys don't know what tempura is, that's Japanese for fried. Yeah. David's been in heat. Obrigado, obrigado. A você. Sushi was amazing. The whole thing is awesome. But last stuff, we have the gelateria artigianale, which means artisanal ice cream. And here, my friend from the same town where my grandfather was born, Gubbio, she's making crepe the Italian way. So what is a crepe? A crepe is a pancake. Woo! This is how they do it in France. In France, lo faccio così. Anche a Italia lo faccio così, no? Bo, bo. Dopo la Nutella. So if you think the Italians like chocolate, they love chocolate, but Nutella is the ultimate chocolate. Hazelnut. Wow. Super thin, crispy, almost like an Indian dosa. It's really amazing. I'm telling her, I'll just eat like this. And by the way, my uncle was her professor. Oh, 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 oh. oh so hot. This is the way you eat in Italy. Mmm. What I love about these cups is that they're not crispy. They're super doughy. With the Nutella, super hot. There's nothing like it. Over here we have chocolate fondue. We have gelatos. I'm going to gelato. I'm not going to have any gelato today, but I'm going to finish this. This is Moscato di Trani. This is a dessert wine. The sugar wine in the southern part of Puglia. This is a de leche. De questo posto. Si, di. Trani, Trani, il nome della villa. Oh, you know what you could tell? It's like a nice dessert wine. The thickness. Emilio. Oh, this is, this is a... This is the dessert. Oh, the best. It's not lot sugar. You taste? No sugar. No, not lot. Not like Porto. No. Porto has no, a lot no, of sugar. No, no, no. Or the, or the in Bordeaux, the Sauternes. The Sauternes, the wine on Bordeaux. This is also... This is phenomenal. Yeah. This is like the best ever. Just, I, I, I propose you just the, the wine exceptional. The exceptional yes. wine. Yes. This guy's too kind. You know, with the one story. This uh, ladies, he have uh, this uh, Castello. Very for the famous for, the, for this wine. Typical and uh, she she like very much the this type of wine. Yes, yeah. yeah. So the, the owner of the vineyard, yeah. uh, she has a castello, so a castle, and she loves this type of wine. I'll tell you, this is one of the best. I'm a dessert wine guy. Oh, I'll take it down. Wow. All right, last stop, guys. Gelato. Gelato is a different type of ice cream. It's like whipped nicely and they pull it out amazingly. Come on, let's do this. It's una, una copa piccola, because for me, I can't do it Ah, look at that. Eh, piano, piano. Oh, and this is chocolato. That means chocolate in Italian, chocolato. And you can see the consistency is different from regular ice cream. So they're from my, uh, from my town too. Gubini, incredible. Okay, dame uno de queste. Let's do this. Grazie. Grazie per questo. Look at that. Questa menta. I'm sharing. I don't care. Chocolata. Mamma mia. Come a la maison. Crazy, huh? The best. This is the ultimate brunch I've ever been to in my life in Luxembourg. When you're in Luxembourg, be here on a Sunday, 11 a.m. You will love it, 11 to 4 p.m., 59 euros. This is epic. Hey, amico, prendiamo yes. un po' più. Un po' di più. Un po' di più. See you guys soon. I'm going to drink more. Happy
je voljo da pati čaro, ljubi ne ni se peli. Domenica prossima, grazie. Italiani veri, grazie ragazzi. Grazie. Ciao, grazie. Ciao.